Hello and welcome to Fabs' Retromania. Oi! I okay. am here, you know. Hello and welcome to Retromania. <laughs> this is Super Mario Bros. 2 Ooh. for the Nintendo Entertainment System. Oh, look at you. Have to use the full words. Can't just say NES like a human being. NES. Nah. <laughs> of course I've got Fabs here. Damn right. Because this is too batch crazy to actually leave him out, really. <laughs> I mean, look at the story. It's it's a thing of beauty, really. Yeah. I'm not quite sure they thought this through. I, I just like the fact, you know, you've got... Mario two... went to a cave nearby. That's clearly Princess Peach. Oh, yeah. <laughs> no, no, this is Toadstool at this point in time. It was Princess Toadstool. None of this Peach bullshit. Okay, so we're going to play it through twice. I'm going to play it through and then Fabs is going to do it. And we're going to heckle each other. So I've got Mario, Stumpy, Longshanks. I'm going to guess a member of the village people. Oh yeah. And, and drag queen. Well, drag princess, sorry. She's not queen yet. We're clearly choosing the drag queen. Oh no. Oh, oh. You need to... There you go. I press the B button. There you go. Quick, go to Ramona Flowers. There you go. This does feel very Scott Pilgrim. As the uh, master of all things Eastern, you can tell us why this isn't particularly the most Mario-esque of Marios. Well, you see, it was in fact, originally when it was released in Japan, it had nothing to do with Mario. It was a rather unusual game called Doki Doki Panic, which translates to something like Dream Factory OMG WTF BBQ or something. Um, and when they released it in the West, they decided to make this a Super Mario game because they didn't release the original Super Mario Bros. 2 because it was too hard for wee gaijin dogs. Of course, they did eventually release it as, um, in the West. Drop that there. Because, um, as the Lost Levels, which we all know as being rather difficult. Quick, grab the mushroom. Shrooms, woo! Now you're better. Aha! Come, noble steed. I shall ride you. Yeah, that's it. You ride the shy guy. He likes it like that. Whoa! Well done. I'm just too used to jumping on things and, like they <laughs> and die this is this is wrong in terms of in terms of mario stuff so you said there was a power jump before yeah i mean you can also run and jump like in other mario Aha. games we could do that you can well. die and oh good lord you're having a seizure I'm not one of the fun seizures either Bad come way. on you're gonna give yourself a headache very soon there you go i already feel like i'm in a 90s drug movie drop it Everything dies. Yay. Wah! Something really strange about the enemies in this game. They're all wearing masks. Except that guy who is a mask. Because he's a ninja. Da -da 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 -da. Yay, now you can play a slot machine. This game encourages... You, you wouldn't get away with that these days. Because you'd have all the moral guardians bitching about how it uh, encourages gambling and such like. What a lot... Well, you remember Alex Kidd, obviously. Oh, Alex Kidd. That's a game where you bet your life on rock, paper, scissors. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Yeah, rock, paper, scissors. In Japan, it's serious business. She does it like she's going incandescent with need for a sh**. <laughs> Please, she's a female. Females don't sh**. Right? There's something I've got to tell you, dude. <laughs> <laughs> oh. So there's a big jump here. Hmm. Which means I have to do a special jump, I guess? Mm, not maybe, uh... I honestly don't recall when I was a wee lad ever using this many special jumps. Throughout the entire game, in fact. There you go. Aha! See? You see, what you don't know is that Young Brown is actually using the NES Advantage with the turbo function on. So what have we learned? Winners don't use drugs. But the NES Advantage is awesome. <laughs> so awesome that you've just thrown yourself off the uh, line. Yeah, and now I'm flying. It's like Mary Poppins, bitch. Thank you, Elevator Dick. That'd be a really weird nickname for a porn star. They call me Elevator Dick. He always goes up and he always goes down. What the f*** are you? A uh, fun fact about Birdo. In Japanese, this was a transsex... Well, not transsexual, sorry, transvestite. They for some... And in fact, no, in the original American um, instruction booklet, yeah, Birdo liked to... was a dude that dressed as a lady. And for some reason, now they've decided, yeah, Birdo's a girl, because we can't have men wear bow ties. Well, not bow ties, bows in their hair or whatever. That's just wrong. There's a bow in there? 
It should be. Maybe it's a later she one. She looks like some weird egg vomiting prick. Which leads to a further question. And now How I've... does that species reproduce? Longshanks. Yeah. It is the year of Luigi after all. Oh yeah, of course. Why? No one's happy about this. What the f*** is wrong with this guy's legs? Um, burrito and it's coming out the wrong end. It's like it's an epileptic fit. It's me! I'm scared of the sh You need to uh, jump on him, take the magic carpet so you can um, then ride it along. Mommy! No. It's a locked! The f***? It's Fanto. I got that! <laughs> Basically, you take his key, he chases you until you die. Well, he sounds like a kind fella. Yeah, he's a bit like me in that regard. Come on the f*** back here! Whoops. <laughs> Game unwinnable! Ooh. Oh well. I'm not dead yet. Oop. Now you are. I am close. Pipes in Mario have now been replaced by pots. And, you know, effectively trading one drug metaphor for another. Run! Run, you crazy plumber! Um, he'll Get... follow you outside, by the way. You what?! Yeah, that's right. Don't f*** with Phantom. I hate you, Phantom. I hate you so much it gives me energy. Oh, well. Well. Right. I suck like... in this game. It's looks all like you. It's Babs' time to shine.